now to understand the usage of all these uh, door zones optimize zone and especially the zone option we'll try to construct an carcass a cabinet of uh, two door with internal doors and internal drawer so that we'll be able to understand how to utilize all these commands for better understanding so for this i will take a partition so again for if you are using internal door this partition should be uh, should have certain offset from the front so i'll give 30 mm and then apply then when i also place this at the center for uh, two doors so you can see it has 30 mm offset similarly i'll place this uh, horizontal at the center and that in uh, this side too i'll switch it to front view i'll remove this centered and i'll place it here so i'll just measure the distance so i'll maintain uh, 800 similar way i'll place another one and i'll check the dimensions so i'll also maintain this one as 800 so this is for uh, again i will divide this into two equal halves using the center to place two drawers so now we are done constructing the partitions now if we are placed uh, planning to do an internal door we will need a filler here so to place a filler here there is an option which i was about to say later that is insertion measure enable this one now come back to elements go to partition so when you click here the element insertion dialog box comes so if you want to insert at right side click right and click ok so before that we should ensure disable this one so it is taking at the center so delete this partition now come again enable this option go back to partition and click and mention right click ok so we got the filler here the same way we will also need the filler on the left side here so mention left then click ok so we got the filler here. now to insert when we are trying to uh, put the drawers when we go to our friends we will see there is a single zone here the zone is not divided so what we will do is since this is a two door we will come here divide it into two equal doors by clicking optimize zone again but we are not getting the zone for installing the to draw a cost so in that case we'll go to this option that is zone what we'll do is we'll delete this entire zone so now this carcass does not have any zone now we'll click on this zone option we'll switch it to front view for better visual uh, presentation now we will left click and drag to create the zones so we are planning to do a single door but again since we are trying to do an uh, drawer box, internal drawer box, first we have to divide the zone like this as, uh, as I am doing. Now, just place the zones in the given place, places. So now, we, now when we go to drawer box, we can see we will be able to put the drawer box. So now, insert the drawer box we, which we need. So before that select the model structure drawer and we'll insert select apply apply so in inserting we are noticing that it is not getting shifted inwards so we have moved everything 30 mm backwards but the drawer box still is 30 mm on the front side so to move them 30 mm inside we will go to doors and zone so we will go to zone we will click on that particular zone and there is an option called as drawer shift or door shift i will enter 30 similarly i will do this for every other drawers so 
so i'm doing this because the door can uh, can be provided internally so now we have moved all the drawers that we have inside so now we will place the drawer fronts again i will select the lion exit door so here we can notice as i said previously it will not cover initially uh covering the side panels or the top panel so we'll go to door doors and zones click on zone offset so you can see it is covering perfectly so this is how we place the internal drawers now coming to place the placement of uh, internal doors now we'll come to doors and zones we are saying that we can we are able to install only on the top part or only on the bottom part we are not able to cover this part so we what we'll do is we'll insert the door here itself here as well as here i'll change this rotation i'll reverse this rotation it is taking yeah. this on this side so what i'll do is click on this i'll change the rotation to left and apply so again we are noticing that we need a single door now what we should do is we'll switch, uh, we'll apply click apply and what we'll do is click okay now we had to what we have to do is we should measure the distance between this end to that distance until the door must come that is until here that will be 1033 now what we should do is we should go back to cabinet edit switch to isometric view we'll go to zones we'll click on this particular door and here the in the zone offset there is the option called as below we'll enter the value 1033 and we should also mention so if i uh, here i consider the exit door the external door so the it is not as if we enable this option then you should click apply we can see we get a single door but in some case if it is an internal door i'll delete this external door we are planning of putting off a uh, internal door so i'll take leon internal door I click on this zone. And click apply. Okay. Now we have got the Leon internal door. Now the same procedure. We will come here. Click on this door. So here we enter the value. We should make sure that we enter this. Ignore the door type. And then click apply. Then we will get door extended as single door. But again, when you see. we will see that the so the hinges are applied only in this particular zone for both both side that case you should come to this option hinge click on the door so here when we scroll we can see it initially it will be according to door zone we will should change to according to door then click apply the same way change here according to door here we can see the hinges are taken considered according to the door size so here i have taken exit door here i have taken internal door so this is the procedure how we uh, put an internal drawer drawer box system with an if you want a planning planning of an external door this is the method if you are planning or doing an internal door this is the method so this is how we construct a simple internal door internal drawer wardrobe